Now, let's see if we could get to- excuse me. Let's see if we could get to that star space before the turn ends, or before Yoshi gets there, whatever happens. Uh, Donkey Kong's going to get himself a lamp, so it's a race against the three of us, even though he's got no money, so I guess he's not really that much of a threat right now. Well, let me just say, um, playing Mario Party, since Mario Party 5 was my first Mario Party game, and I feel like I played 6 as well before 5, before 4, uh, either way, just going from 5 to 4, and... Uh, seeing that Donkey Kong was playable, it was just really singing cool because I- oh great. I remember Donkey Kong is like this super cool- I don't know what's up with Daisy's arms when she does this, she's like very weird looking arms. Uh, whatever. Let's see if I get coins. You can actually control the speed if you hold up then it goes faster, if you hold back it goes slower. I don't know, Daisy's arms are just always weird like that, but whatever. Um, I remember it was just so weird because Donkey Kong was like this super cool being who uh, it was like a superior being than all the other characters because he always helped out with board events and stuff. But then I got to play as him, it was like super awesome and everything. The only one who cares, but whatever. What is with you, Koba Kid? I'm getting really stinking sick of you at this point. I don't see where singing Bowser is. Right now, you're cool dad. And just show up. Oh, wait, I think it's happening. Yeah. Well, you can't see it because it just sped through the text, but whatever. You can pause it and see that Koba Kid just called Bowser his dad, and Bowser's really big in this game for some reason. Bowser Shuffle! Uh, oh, that's actually helpful for me because he shuffles everyone on the board. Uh, oh, I thought we were all just switching places, but no, he puts us all in completely random. Oh, wait, no, Donkey Kong's there. My bad. I just couldn't see him under there. Uh, so hopefully I'm back over to where the star is. Well, actually, I don't think anyone was in the blue squadron besides me. Hide and go boom. I don't know why I keep seeing that lately, but whatever. Because my boy Kasim in American Idol was singing that like five years ago, and I don't know why I'm acting like it's relevant because it was like five years ago. When's the Naked Brothers Band reunion happening? I thought like that got confirmed, but like I haven't heard anything about it since. Maybe it was just in my fantasy of that happening because Naked Brothers Band is awesome. I feel like I have a Naked Brothers Band sticker or poster somewhere in my room, but it's covered with another poster. Excuse me while I get up and examine my room to look for hidden Naked Brothers Band memorabilia. Anywhere in here, where I think it is. Not here, not here. I remember it being hidden, like somewhere under a poster. It's like a secret bookshelf. Yeah, some people have secret bookshelves. I have a secret Naked Brothers Band poster. I don't know. Actually, I think I know where it is, and it's like uh, hidden back. It's like behind the game shelf, so I can't get to it right now. Uh, if I can find I'll take a picture of it or something like that. It looks like we won, but <laughs> was so, I'm so stupid. Oh my god, I'm the worst up here ever. I'm gonna go out with a Bane, that's for sure. Get it, Bane, hide and go boom. <laughs> I'm just so singing happy. Maybe I am high on 69! Yeah, I'm high on 69. I'm high on Wisdom Tooth juice because I'm like, this has been so stinking weird. I don't know what's going on, but whatever. I'm happy, I'm having fun. <laughs> high on 69. What was I trying to say? I'm talking about something. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why am I laughing? Oh my god. What? <laughs> why? Why? Welcome to Vegas, baby! Uh, where the fruit am I? Oh, I'm here. Okay. Uh, you guys have coins. You know, I'm just using this. Um. What was I going? Okay, my game shelf, it's been full for a really stinking long time. That's also a reason why I didn't want to show off the my room in the anniversary videos anymore because I can't display all my games anymore because it's like I need a new stinking shelf. This is a very crummy roll. Um, 11! Stranger Things! Waffles! Eggos! Lego my Ego! But, um... Oh! Wow! I actually get- I used the Mega Mushroom and I got the Happening Space and I got to go back to where the star is. That's super cool. Okay, cool. I'm so stinking happy. What's going on? What game are we playing? I, my game shelf, I was ne in need of a new one because I ran out of space on it, but then I thought of putting them in my dresser because, like, I got no clothes in there anymore because I only own, like, two shirts. <laughs> um, so I tried putting games in there, but the drawers weren't, like, wide enough for me to place them in there the way I wanted to. 
Um, but it turns out that just the top two drawers are shorter than all the rest, so I can put the games into the lower ones, which is weird, but it works, so I'm in no need of space anymore. This is a very weird topic, I don't understand, but I think I've gotten the green squadron ch uh, shown off in this board more often than any previous playthrough of this board in existence. That was a sentence and a half. No, literally, it was a sentence and a half because, like, it just went on and on and then just stopped randomly, so it quite literally could have been a sentence and a half. What game are we playing? Avalanche. I don't know why I was laughing. Like, that was just weird. I just... I don't understand. No, I have not ever... drugged or drank or... ski and swim. I don't know. Uh, let's just keep on going. Get out of my way, Yoshi! And... Uh, I feel like there's just a rock waiting for me. Where's the hill? Thank you. There's the hill. And... Okay, that was a very funny pose! Jesus! Get out, get out, get out! One minigame I didn't win, hooray. I can vigorously crack. Just pretend it's the crackling of the snow. Wah! Wouldn't funny if like an alligator just popped up right when he was going over. And that's a pretty standard pose, okay. I like Daisy back there is just like, yep, that's me. Probably wondering how I got in this situation. Uh, 63, not school 69. <laughs> I'm just so stinking weird. Oh my god, what's next? What turn are we on? Last three turns, I think? Last two turns! We're just speeding through this thing. We got a one. That's so, so sad for DK. Is a magic lamp, but not enough coins to use it. You could just use it for the fun of it, because it's just fun to see uh, the good old genie and hear me sing some other variation of a friend like me. And hooray, I get another star! Gonna do that. Yay! I got it! Well, that was actually pretty good. I'm proud of myself. I can still do the Daisy voice. The OG Daisy. What is with them all being in the blue zone? What the fruit? Okay. I'm not complaining, but still. Oh, please be a magic lamp in here. Please. Oh, that would have been amazing. Is anyone near the. I just want to make sure no one's near Boo, because if they are, I should probably get one of those. I could use a chomp call, change the star space, have a- oh my- I, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna do something funny. A uh, swap card, I don't know if we've seen this before, trades items. I'm gonna do something funny. Uh, let's see, return? View map, I wanna see who's- is anyone at Boo? I'm about to go to Boo! Huh, how much- money do I have to- so 20 coins for a star, so that would be- that might take me down to 50, and then it takes 50 for, to steal a star. I was gonna do chomp call, and have the chomp send the star back over here, but there's- it's not guaranteed that would happen, and it would probably be difficult to get to it, so never mind. Uh, that would've been singing hilarious, though, so just don't buy anything, and keep on going. Oh, you are here! God darn it, I forgot about you, jerk. Alright, the ultimate showdown, right at the end! He gets a five. Ugh. Even odds. I think. Math is hard. Yay! Nine! Oh, but now I have no. Uh, whatever. Math is singing hard. I don't know if I have enough or not. Go down. One, two. Oh, Bowser's coming. Wait, no, is that Bowser? Chance time. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, boy. Yay! I got it! Is it still in the blue? Okay, no, it's not. Time to change the odds. Time to tip the scales. Oh, yay, Bowser. Hooray. I prefer Bowser over uh, Chance Time of Death. <laughs> Please give us a Bowser minigame because we just need to have one in the sneaking LP. Of course not. Uh, taking 30 coins from just me, Gray. Oh, but that means I can't. Oh, come on, Koba Kid. I was gonna get a stinking cool boo. Star steal right at the end. Cause, god darn it. We need a coin collecting mini game or lucky mini game in order for me to pull this off. I don't know why I'm complaining. It's like obviously I'm gonna win, but still I wanna win bigger and better than everyone. I it's not happening. Cool. Well, don't blame me, blame it on the crane. That was a crummy segue. What do we got? Blame it on the crane, it's a new minigame. And I think it's also Mario Party Top 100, and they changed it in a way that made me angry somehow. Probably that just sounds correct. One player uses a crane to try and capture the other three players. The other three must try to avoid the long claw of the law. Wait, wrong minigame. Uh, we just try and grab them. Uh, the shy guys do absolutely nothing. They're just there to be in the way, so don't bother. And then the other guys just walk around if they can. 
Oh, shy guy. I wish you were a playable character in a Mario Party game. That wasn't complete garbage. Uh, eh. Of course it didn't work. Uh, you can actually, if you hold down the A button, then it just, like, goes in and out. So if you do it a little too early, like I just did, then you could save yourself, possibly. Oh, it does automatically eventually? I didn't know that. God singing darn it. Okay, well, now that I'm kind of concerned. They're all bunched up in a little place, so just grab someone. Thank you. Get Yoshi. And let's see if we can get another one. If I miss one now, then I think I'm going to lose the entire mini game. Oh, I always go like too early thinking I'm going to like cl like click him into it, but that's not how this game works. Uh, I might have a little bit of a chance left. Like, it takes 10 seconds for them to come over here. Yeah, DK! And that was my last chance to get Waluigi! Waluigi! Come on, buddy! Big money, no whammies! Yeah! Also, I like how Waluigi's black in this game, and then because Wario takes purple, because Daisy takes yellow. Very weird how all the color schemes work and stuff, because Wario came before Daisy, so why isn't he yellow? I don't know why they gave him purple early on, or did they not do the color scheme thing back then? I don't know. Whatevs. Little design choices that only I care about and nobody else. And his last turn, correct? Domundo, yes. I do not have the ability to steal a star, unless, like, someone gives me ten coins somehow in some magical way in this last turn. Donkey Kong does not seem like he's gonna do that for me, though. Oh, please, can we get a nine? Come on, Donkey Kong, get a nine! Ten! Oh, that would've been great if we got that. Oh, I guess we can't have too much 69 celebration in one LP. Did you? Uh, DK sitting on the little thing. Looks very funny. And kick the booty. I like how there's no explanation. It's not like, step on up and come on to the thing. You wanna do it? No, it's just like, oh, I stepped on this. Now I'm just gonna jump up here and sit down. And then I get spanked in the booty by a Goomba. See, sometimes no dialogue makes things better and funnier and stuff. Waluigi is going to have nothing of interest happen. 69! Yes! There's nothing of interest. My butt a 69 just happened. So I can't steal coins from Waluigi because I would just ruin that 69. Uh, so I guess we're gonna be stealing from DK. I don't care. I don't care if Waluigi has more coins. He's got a singing 69. You can't interrupt a man who just got a 69 on the last turn. <laughs> I'm so stinking dumb. Oh, we got that. We got some more sporks. <laughs> See you later. Three, two, one. And back come full circle. That's not a sentence. Back come full circle. Put that on a shirt and sell it. Except not really, because no one would buy it. And Yoshi, gonna do anything interesting on this last turn, or probably not. Get seven corns, and I don't even know where the fruit you are. You made yourself mega, so even if you had enough points to get the star, you cannot get it because you are the mega Yoshi. And that was about as eventful as I thought it was going to be. Okay, last turn, let's go, last mini game. Watch this one. Oh, it would be funny if that was a lucky mini game. Uh, slime time, please. Oh, good turn. Oh, hey, it's the long call of the law, like I just mentioned. At least we're ending on a new mini game. Catch the character shown in the wanted poster three times to win. Rotate right, rotate left, move up and down, catch the character. Catch a character, just gotta find the guy you're looking for. We're looking for a bomb, jeez. Want a bomb, I don't think I want to get in the way of him though. Uh, so we're just gonna go back and forth. Let's see. Just for whoever's in here. Nope. Uh. Oh, hey, wait, no, that was a chain chomp. I did see you down here though. If you could open up, that'd be nice. Oh, wait, no, that was a chain chomp. God darn it. I think. Come on, Babom. Yes, there you go. Gonna get three of them though. Uh, come on. Nope. Mm, yes. And uh, yes. Oh, that was a close game, actually. And they're so happy! Hooray! We got arrested for murder! I think maybe it wasn't murder. They didn't, they didn't specify in the wanted poster. Maybe it was tax fraud or something. Even though that's Yoshi's department. And with that, we are done with Goomba's Greedy Gala. Our gala has reached its finale. Let's check out the results. First, let's check the number of stars. Yeah, we got this song and dance and every single character introduction or finale thingy dialogue segue. 69! Oh, I was one coin away from sharing in the 69 goodness. How sad. Uh, now let's get to the bonus stars. Let's see what we got. First one goes to... Daisy! Oh my god, I'm so surprised! I had no idea. And yeah, it's getting old at this point. 
Coin star. I actually don't know who this goes to. Daisy, hooray! Daisy's a winner! I love her old voice so stinking much. I really hate how they made her super stinking annoying. I know it's like to differentiate her from Peach, but like, my god, it's so stinking annoying in the new games. Happening star goes to... Daisy! And now the final results! Yeah, I see you, Yoshi. I see you staring at me over there. <laughs> I don't know, it's just so weird. Why do her eyes shift over to the right every time, like, in this final board? Does it always happen or is it just here where I can see it? Boop, boop. And the winner is Daisy! And I'm celebrating by vigorously tapping my foot because I don't have hands! I just thought of how it'd be funnier if he just had like magical floating hands that showed up just for when he wanted to clap. And my phone's ringing, BRB. Jesus Christ, oh my god. I just tangled my foot on a suitcase in a way that is very awkward and I don't know how to untangle myself. Okay, there you go. Ugh. This has been a board and a half, which has been like a three quarters of a board because we usually do 20 turns, but whatever. It's been very seem weird. Like. I say I'm not drunk, but if anyone accused me of being drunk throughout this board, I would not say that they were wrong, basically. Even though I just said I wasn't drunk, but whatever. Uh, Waluigi, uh, you deserve something that isn't last place because you got a 69, but whatever. Uh, detailed results, in case we wanted to see those. Got 6 stars, 70 coins, 132, okay then. Uh, 69 here for Waluigi. Uh, blue spaces, red spaces, happening spaces. No chance time, thankfully. Three, four, five Bowser spaces, my god. And this is like without the help of sinking uh, the last five turns thing. And one battle game and a lot of items. And some springs. Okay, we're good. Let's go. And he's still doing the foot tapping. It's just like, I like his little dance when he does. He's like going back and forth. It's like, congratulations, Daisy. Or congrats. No, he's too cool for a full blown congratulations. So about that present, they're generous people. But I'm not one of them. Wow. You gotta beat me at a mini game to get it. <laughs> Join me in a classic chip flip battle. Do I need to show you how to play? All right, here's the skinny. <laughs> And I just realized his spray is completely frozen right now. It's not breathing like I am. Goomba? Goomba, are you okay? Goomba! No. It's just sprite limitations or something. There are numbers on each of the chips out there. Pick a chip and then add its number to the points to your points total. We'll take turns picking and I'll even let you go first. Whoever gets the 50 points first is the winner. Use the controls thing and we just go ground pound on them. It's that simple. All right, then let's get it on like Donkey Kong, even though he's not here. And I don't believe it actually matters because like it gets shuffled in a completely random ways. I don't think it can keep track of it or anything like that. Because it's very stinking confusing. Star! Start! I go first? Yeah, I do! Let's get ourselves five points, right? So it's completely luck based and okay, we're completely even evenly matched. It's such an intense fight. No. I don't know how singing poker commentators even do their job, because like it's like how do you call it skill? It's just all luck based and stuff. I don't understand. But oh, that's why I get for insulting the poker gods, I guess. 20 points, jeez. Uh, let's go with this one. Uh, another three. We can't keep on getting the chump change. Oh, jeez. We're not going to win this one. There's no way. No way in hecky, Mr. Spaghetti. Uh, I keep on getting the threes. My god. Uh, I still have a chance, possibly. I need Goomba to get like a minus one if I want to have any hope. I still have hope, oh my god. Uh, nope, minus 10, Jesus. Alright, you won, Goomba. Good for you. At least you get to see his little happy tappy. I like how he taps his feet when he's in the air, that's really funny. Whoa, that smarts. Would you like to try Goomba again? Sure. Not like I want to complete the LP or anything like that, I'll just do it for the heck of it. No, do not explain the play. Let's get it on. 
Right, let's see if I can actually keep track of it this time. So... Huh. If they aren't completely random, then this... This and this one should be a 20. I don't know why I'm saying this out loud, because Goomba's obviously watching me, so I shouldn't do it while uh, commentating just standing here, but whatever, let's see if this is a 20. It is a 20! Oh, so they aren't completely random. I like how we got a negative 10. Um, no, it doesn't actually count as a negative 10, unfortunately. Oh, okay, so maybe I was just lucky, or maybe I lost track of it. I don't think I know. So, yeah, because he got the minus 10 thing first, it doesn't actually count towards anything, which is kind of lame. Uh, was that a... Oh, just a regular 10. We got 35. Let's go with this one. Uh, regular 5. Okay, just need 10 more points. Got 10. If I could get that 20, that'd be really cool! Three. Oh, the return of the threes. Uh, yep, got the return of the threes, alright. Yep, got threes! Uh, minus five. Okay, good, good, good. Let's go over to this one. And we're good! 51! Game Theory's Daisy and Alien? No. Cause Tatanga was what I trying to marry or no. But 51? No. But it's just a theory. You did it, Daisy. So... Here's your present. Wow. Wow. You got Daisy's Daisies. Seriously, how do they not call them Daisy's Daisies? Instead, they're just Daisy's Flowers. How lame. And very spiky looking flowers, in fact. But it's not just Daisy's Flowers, it's Daisy's Flowers. Along with Daisy's Flowers! Yeah, you get two of them. Put Daisy's Flowers in the present room. And with that, we are finished with Goomba's Greedy Gala. More than halfway done with the boards. We got Toads with Mimo. Next time on Daisy Party, we are going to Boo's Haunted Bash, my favorite board in Mario Party 4. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night. I really have nothing to say during the, like, the freeze frame part, sorry. I'm not creative, this is me, it's just a mini thing. Maybe I could have, maybe I could have like a, a space on the Mario Party 4 board whenever I land on a specific space, then the Mario Land thing activates. Uh, hello, get the mushroom, get that, get that. Uh, land on, I said land on the Koopa, Koopa Troopa. Wanna go down the pipe? Yes I can, cool. Oh, it's the exact same, it's like almost the exact same thing as before. Oh, get that block, get that block. Do, 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 do. And jump around here. Uh, hit this. I uh, could go down both right. Uh, I don't really care about coins, but coins do equal one up, so I guess I should take the time to explore around. And because I'm. Oh, no, 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 come on! Uh, because I wasn't big, I couldn't break that block and get those other coins. Oh well, I still got a life. Or did I get a life? I don't think I know. I got five lives now. Uh, just gonna wait for that thing. Oh jeez, okay. I want to try to get through the game without using save states. I'm doing so good, so far so good. It's also the second time I had to buy a game twice because I'm using the 3DS capture card, which doesn't have all my save data on it. So, and since the download only game, I had to purchase it. So I had to buy Ikachan and Mario Land for this, for the sake of being a Let's Play master or something. I don't know. It was very cheap, so don't worry about it. Because uh, I'm sure you're all concerned about the financial status of Midnight and Beyond. I'm sure you all lose hours of sleep over it. Uh, just gonna go this way. Uh, something I never liked about the old Mario games is that you can't go backwards when you move forward. I don't know why that is. It's just like for memory storage purposes. I have no idea. Uh, if we could get that. What the fruit? Uh, I think if you get a game over, you start from the very beginning of the game, like, uh, just like the original Mario Bros. So, for the sake of not being here forever, if we get down to one life, I am gonna probably save, a uh, state, because I don't wanna have to put up with that nonsense. Uh, just go through here with the power of the can-can, and get- okay, cool. He Mario just slows down whenever he jumps in the air, which is always nerve-wracking. Oh, cool, checkpoint, so we don't have to worry about that. At least I don't know what this is that keeps popping its head off, but it's very annoying. And jump up here. 
Uh, avoid the seahorses of death. It's a super seahorse. Uh, okay. Uh, avoid that. Hit that. And... Oh, jeez. Go over here. And here. And land on this. The only complaint I have about Piranha Plant being the optional... Or not being the oddball. Because every Smash Bros. game has an oddball character in... You know, uh, Melee was Rob, uh, Brawl was Rob, or Melee was Game & Watch. I don't know what's up with my speaking today, I'm sorry. Melee was Game & Watch, Brawl was Rob, uh, Smash Bros. Wii Fit Trainer, and then, oh jeez. And then Ultimate is Piranha Plant. The only complaint I have about Piranha Plant is that it isn't from a completely random game series. I would kind of prefer if it was just like a Brain Age character or an Nintendogs character or something like that. But oh well, hello, we're in a submarine now. We all live in a gray submarine, a gray submarine, or possibly a green submarine if you're using one of those green lit background game boys. Oh geez, so sick and worrisome. So the thing that I like to do in these types of games, these horizontal or vertical shooters, is just focus on your character. Don't really focus on what you're shooting, just keep on shooting at all times, you'll hit stuff regardless, but more so focus on the character that you're trying to protect. Uh, giving advice on uh, bit-sized games that have been around for 80 million years, I guess. I don't know. Or maybe the UFO is supposed to belong to Tatanga we saw in the distance or something like that. We're on the trail of him. It's the epic storytelling! I get it. I understand now. Get all this stuff. Uh, I could get away. Get the mushroom. Very good. I believe if you get super flowers, you get the ability to rapid fire. Though I could be wrong on that. Uh, if we could find one, that'd be nice. Uh, if we could get away from all these fish, that would also be nice. Uh, just avoid the seahorse, thank you. Hit him. Get the squid. Uh, take a couple of hits to get rid of them. The little squid. Oh, it's shaped like an- Ooh, it's- Give me an M! Give me an A! Give me an R! Give me an I! Give me an O! What does that spell? Wasted coin potential! Hooray! And I got hit because of it. Great. Uh, get rid of all these things. Hit the seahorse. Uh, and oh, we got evil music. That means a boss is here. Let's see if we can get through without dying. He's got to take a million hits, and I need like just one hit to get taken down. I smell unfairness here in this water. Maybe it's just the fact that you swim around in a bunch of fish poop and stuff. I like swimming in the pool, but like, I, I do not understand the appeal of beaches because you're just swimming around in a bunch of fish poop and bird poop and possibly people poop. They go pooping in the water. I don't like it. I like pools though because they're away from other human beings. <laughs> Go in here. And they decide to fake us out once again. Good old tradition. Thank you, Mario. Oh, Daisy. Zo MG, it wasn't actually Daisy. I had no idea. And they're gone. Or no, okay, now they're gone. I see. Uh, let's see if we can do this. Oh, thank you! I don't know how I'm good at that, but whatever. Extra life, extra life, extra life. 